so we, we want to show you that we didn't just drill it. I think there's some examples of that we showed our guys. When we have population, here's one of our four Ps, what happens? All right, so we're, we're in a, one of our simulated pressures. We're bringing an inside linebacker. We're dropping out one of our edge defenders. So he ends up being in a window that maybe they don't anticipate. And again, we've got extra population. Even though the quarterback feels like there's a pressure, we get an unblocked guy because they're an empty. He has to throw too quick and it, extra population. Now we gotta work on his, his return skills. And again, being able to get an offense to feel pressure, but really we're only rushing four so that we've got extra population in areas that they're not maybe used to them being or expecting them to be. Again, we're in a zero pressure here. Because we've got population with double edge pressure, get a ball tipped. And again, we talk to our guys all the time. The ball's on the one yard line here, about to go in. Having, having the mentality, the purpose that, hey, we're gonna find a way to take a ball away, no matter where it is. We're not giving in to anything. And when you have population, guys going hard, getting off blocks, playing with that purpose, Good things happen. Again, we play a lot of vision in our, in our zone coverages. So when the ball's thrown, we expect guys to break on footballs. Ball's tipped. We get population. We got more guys around the ball than they do. Good things happen. 